GT Mastermind here with another video. Yesterday I uploaded a video of this new portal block that turns on and off the portal. Today I'm going to be showing you how it worked because yes that was a April Fool's Day a video. And I'll show you how it works. First of all, there is actually a resource pack. Take that off, and you'll see what it looks like. This is what it looks like without the resource pack when you're using it. The commands are at zero, zero, and we're not that far away from it and also the spawn I believe is in zero zero so and they're under the floor of the of the world so we'll just teleport down there here they are right here Here, this is for when you turn the portal off. What it's doing is testing for if the daylight detector is inverted. It would, if it is, send out a redstone signal through the comparator into the block. Remove the portal blocks and change the bottom part of the, which is going back and forth to slime, a slime block which is the actual model of the piece that toggles the on and off and ju I just replaced the slime block and the glass block and it's pretty much the same thing for turning it on instead we're filling it with portal the portal block and replacing the slime of glass and as for the nether pretty much the same thing but any if any of you were clever enough and had very good eyes you will see when I came down here there was a sneak peek of a comparator down here that you could see. And this is space, and it's the same thing as in the overworld. But it's controlling this one, this portal here, to do that. That's how I did that. So, uh, thank you for watching this and see you in the next video. Bye bye.